Hello everyone, this is Keith Park, your condo analyst. Today we're going to review the South Forest Hill residences coming to Forest Hill neighborhood, highly coveted, prestigious neighborhood in Toronto. Probably one of the most expensive neighborhoods to live in uh, in terms of resale housing prices and a very safe, wonderful combination of public transit and the nature in a very quiet neighborhood. Let's dive right in with the location. The location is 63 Montclair Avenue, steps from the Forest Hill Village. Uh, here's the location. Let me do a 3D satellite view to zoom in and show you exactly where it's located. Here it is. So these rows of houses are going to be redeveloped into South Forest Hill residences. And the location is actually perfect because it's only a two minute walk to the St. Clair West Heath entrance which is located just here. So you could walk out this way and then go into the subway directly through this uh, laneway, or you can come out to this road and go to the subway station. Very conveniently located. This is very nice area uh, called the Forest Hill Village. And there's a reason why it's called the Forest Hill Village. Let me give you a little tour using the Google Maps. So here we go. You get all the amenities that you need in the neighborhood. So you have some cleaners, uh, you have the subway, coffee shops, and if we walk down a little bit more, uh, there is a small grocery store, uh, some Mediterranean Grill restaurant, and a few banks so you can take care of your banking needs. If you go down this way a little bit more, there's the RBC and the Scotiabank, and down further, HSBC and BMO located over there, so lots of banks. LCBO is also conveniently located here, and some Starbucks coffee. Your dental needs to be taken care of, a freshie, and also the TD Bank over there. Um, very, very nice neighborhood in the very heart of Forest Hill. Yep, so there's, there's a lot of things in this little Forest Hill village. And good to go back to the where the Forest, South Forest Hill residences is. You walk down this way and then here. Steps to the village, which is quite nice. Let's talk about school a little bit because there are a few very, very nice private schools in the neighborhood, one of which is St. Michael's College. As you can see with the huge football field right in the middle of the school, uh, this is the St. Michael's private school, St. Michael's College, as you can see, a Catholic school. And it's only steps away from it, so two minute walk to St. Michael's College. Also, another really big school and renowned school is this uh, UCC, Upper College Canada. I am sure you've heard of it if you are in this neighborhood. So if you zoom out a little bit, the walking distance to UCC, let me show you how far it is. UCC Lonsdale is actually a 12 minute walk. I would say with my walking speed, about 10 minutes. It's about a kilometer, nicely located. Also, there is another public school that's really nice. My younger brother went to Forest Hill Junior. Um, it's 13 minute walk from the South Forest Hill residences, which is also very nice. And where you see all these greenery, these are all trails here. It's a ravine and a walking trail, biking trail, uh, which connects to a much larger trail system eventually. Uh, it also connects down south this way and you can get to uh, Yorkville if you follow this path. Very nice, highly coveted neighborhood, very prestigious neighborhood, lots of luxurious houses, and also the real estate prices in this neighborhood is quite high, very, very high. So the opportunity to get into a condominium in this neighborhood, and not just only any condominium, this is actually a luxurious condominium with lots of attractive features uh, that defines luxury. Let's talk about the TTC subway a little bit. If you take this subway, you can get to U of T within 10 minutes uh, using the TTC subway. It runs every four minutes at this time. 
and this is where the University of Toronto is located. So you can conveniently go to the University of Toronto and also the distance to Union Station is about 20 minutes and once you get to the Union Station, you can access the airport using the UP Express train. And the Yorkdale Shopping Mall is only a one, two, three, four subway stations away. So your shopping needs are met. And you can also walk to Casa Loma. Casa Loma is only a 17 minute walk distance. And it's a nice quick walk through some really nice ravines. And if you look at all these uh, green stuff, there is a lot of trails, biking trails, running trails. I think, I believe it's about 16 kilometers of trail that's in your neighborhood. So in summary, being able to live in a very nice, luxurious, prestigious neighborhood, number one, Forest Hill, and number two, having the proximity to the TTC subway so you can have the public transit to go north or south, east or west, using the streetcar. St. Clair has a dedicated track for the streetcars to move east and west and the TTC subway to go north or south. Very nicely conveniently located. There are very good public and private school options all within the walking distance, which is a huge plus. If you have to pick one neighborhood in Toronto to raise a family, Forest Hill would be absolutely one of your top choices to consider. And that's why the, the houses in this neighborhood are extremely expensive and the average income in this neighborhood is also very, very high. Let's review the brochure together. Just to give you a little bit more detail about this project, the developers are Parallax and Westdale Properties, very reputable developers. I trust these uh, developers. The probability of something going wrong with these developers are just pretty much zero. Um, there will be condominiums and townhouses. I believe it's two towers. 20 stories and 21 stories, a uh, total of 474 residential suites. So no studios in this condominium. So suite types are from one bedrooms to three plus 10. I think the larger suites are going to be more popular in this neighborhood as there will be some downsizers who don't want to leave the neighborhood, but also don't want to take care of their 5,000, 6,000 square foot mansions because either they become empty nesters and the kids are all grown up and or they want to travel the world and live in a smaller space so they're going to have to maintain a huge house. As you can see from the renderings, it is actually very, very luxurious building. Some of these features you'll see only see at the hotel lobbies and that's exactly what this condominium is going for. And if you look at closely, you can see that there is a staircase that does a spiral up type of staircase, which is a very rare touch in any condominium. Uh, so there is going to be some spa and wellness center, outdoor social lounges, as you can see from this rendering, and an inside residence lounge. Let's actually see what is included in the condominium. A 24-hour executive concierge, grand two-story lobby and a fireside lounge, six high-speed elevator, and hotel-inspired climate protected. Uh, this is what we call the port cochere. Port Cochere is a very nice feature in any condominium. State-of-the-art fitness studio, dedicated yoga and spin studio, work from home studio, social fireside lounge, two outdoor lounges, a barbecue with a grill and dining area, indoor and outdoor children's playroom with parents lounge, dining room, gaming room, screening room, wellness spa and a hot plunge. I gotta love the hot plunge. Treatment room, steam room, sauna room, meditation garden, and much more. Once again, uh, zero minutes to Forest Hill Village, two minutes to the subway's entrance, two minutes to the Cedar Vale Park and Ravine, 10 parks within a five minute walking distance, 14 tennis courts within a five minute walking distance, and 16 kilometers of running and biking trails. Eight minutes to Yorkdale via subway, eight minutes to the University of Toronto, 10 minutes to Young and St. Clair via streetcar, 12 minutes to Yorkville, by subway, 20 minutes to Union Station, and 24 minutes to the Vaughan Metropolitan Center. Let me show you a few renderings of the South Forest Hill. As you can tell, the outside material is not like a typical condominium. It's actually using very nice material. And the design is one of those where it's a timeless design. This building is going to age very, very well. Another look at the Port Cochere and the tower and the base. Very nice. I love the rendering of this building currently. 
and the lobby. Wonderful design elements uh, throughout the building. I really like this project. Uh, South Forest Hill. It's going to be launching shortly. All the pricing and floor plans and brochures are available in the link in the description box. Please click it and then you will get access to everything that you need to review this project. In terms of average prices, we're looking at about $1,800 per square foot. The expected completion date would be anywhere from 2026, 2027, 2028. I'm not sure exactly which date it is yet because the project hasn't launched at the time of this video recording. However, by the time you were watching this video, the prices and floor plans will all be available. So click in the link in the description box to get access to that. I think this is a very nice opportunity to be in a very nice neighborhood. I am personally considering purchasing a unit in this building myself. If you're interested in this condominium, please do give me a call at this number 416-493-3955. Once again, my name is Key Park. I am a developer approved broker for Parallax and Westdale. I've been helping my clients find their perfect pre-construction condominiums for the past few years. And as a previous head of analytics at a consulting firm, I use data to figure out which condominiums are best for investments and or personal use. So do reach out to me uh, if you're interested. If you like this video, please click subscribe and turn the notification button on so you won't be missing any of the uploads. I hope you have enjoyed this video. I have more condominium content in my YouTube channel. So if you like to review some of the other videos, check out my YouTube channel and hopefully you can find more valuable information about some of the condominiums that you're interested in. Thank you very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next video. Take care and have a great day.